You have two different kinds of salt. One's just bigger than the other. This is for more of the bottom and to drain over. The other one's more to like bigger. The, the bigger one is more for the ice. The smaller one's more for the water. You know what? I think I should use a fan maybe. I think that might help because it's probably get the ice colder from the wind, cold wind. And the temperature is about negative one. I'm not gonna run and get it. Almost negative two. So what do you think you learned from the first one that made the second one even better? I, I should have added more salt. I should have measured the water better because it just showed one or two particles of what was going to happen in the experiment that will make it more solid. You're supposed to have it so it's quite visible in the bottom. And I, did, I barely had any salt. I just added a little bit and the temperature didn't drop as much. And then also, I didn't work as well the experiment. I didn't measure the water right. So you know how I said the water should be almost even with the glass? Mm -hmm. Remember I drained some of the water, but before, because of the ice, I could make it colder. But before, it was about the same. And it, right now it's three, almost half the way to negative three. So, how long have you been filming? 14 minutes. I really think I'm doing this a little bit longer than it should be done. Uh, I think I'm going to do the experiment now. Ready? What are you going to do? Hold on. Uh, do you see how it's freezing? That represents hail. That's how hail forms. Jesus Christ, I don't like the way it's coming down on the port. I have to do something about that. There's a little bit of ice like, and lots like in, more from the moisture in the air and the water. So they're like what, what, ice shards. So all you did was drop in this one piece of ice. And then the whole entire tube started to freeze. Kind of like hail would with the moisture of the air with the water. It will be falling and will form more because there's a lot more rain and water and it's going to be a lot colder. Whereas, see, if I were to dump the water, so you got a good shot. You can see the ice particles. You could see the ice particles just evaporated. the warm. Exactly. If it's that cold, it would usually stay frozen solid. And that's really just the experiment. See how hail forms. You can do that with thermometer, stirring, ice, water, salt, and a test tube beaker. And maybe a fan. And that's really it. All right. Look at all that salt. Mm -hmm. And that's just half of it, because the other stuff forms the ice. So this is the cleanup? Yep, just washing it out.